In this video, we're going to learn how to paste or concatenate strings together. So basically merging two strings together. So I'm gonna go ahead and create two strings. So I'm gonna say hello, and I'm gonna have my Y be world. And then I can highlight this and run it. And so now we have these two strings. And if we wanna create a hello world, what we can do is use the function paste. And so with paste, we can have it be X and Y. And when we run this, we see we get hello world with a space in between. And this space is there because the default separator of a paste is a space. But if we actually wanted these to be combined together with no space in between it, we can do paste X, Y, and then we can do SEP, that's the marker for a separator, and we're just gonna do quotations here with nothing between. So if we run that, you see we get hello world combined together. So it's not separated out anymore by the space. Well, you can also do other characters there. So if we do X and Y, and we're gonna make our separator a comma instead, we can run this. And don't forget your equal sign there. There you go, you get hello comma world. So this can be really helpful if you're trying to take a string and then add to it some form of variable. So if we had a variable that was name, we could do something like if J is a name, so we're just gonna use my name, Elena, you can do something like paste X J and then the separator is going to be a comma space. And so if we run this, gotta run my J first for you guys, and then run this guy. So then we get hello, Elena. So this is a way that you can concatenate a string together to be able to use with a dynamic field. The other thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna bring up, I'm gonna set my DF to be equal to this MPG right here. And so I'm gonna go ahead and run that. And so if you look at MPG, this is just a data set that comes within Tidyverse. You can see it has manufacturer here and model here. So what if we wanted these to actually, we wanted one column that had both the manufacturer and the model in it. So what we could do is we could make DF manufacturer, and I'm just gonna do hyphen model is equal to paste, and then we want to put in the two columns we want to paste together. So we want our DF manufacturer and then our DF model. And then we want our separator to look like this is and be a hyphen there. So we're going to do that set equals and then that hyphen string there. So when we run that, oh, it doesn't like my hyphen there. So we're going to do dot model and I'm just going to change the separator here and run that. So now it ran, and if we come over here, we can see we now get Audi.a4, Audi.a4 Quattro, and we have now one column that's the paste of the manufacturer and the model together. So now if you wanted to run things on it, you could easily run things on this pasted column together. And you could also do a specific string whenever you're pasting too. So we can do DF new model, is going to be equal to paste. We're gonna just gonna do the string new, and then we're gonna do df model, and then we're gonna do separator. We're just gonna leave the separator off. We're gonna let it be the, the default of a space. So if we run that and look at this, you can see that all of these have new in front of it. So it works anyway with static or dynamic fields, and you can use it in a database or just in strings as well.